Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hello and welcome, my name is Katie. This is a shopping haul and if you have been around recently, you know that I went on a little night away to Southampton with one of my friends and did some shopping and bits and bobs. So this video is going to be what I got in Primark because I did need some new clothes. This one um, we went to previously but it wasn't as good as last time so I didn't get as much. Still got a fair bit though but um, yeah so just down here. So if you would like to know what I picked up in Primark for April 2023 then make sure you keep on watching. Let's get some of the boring bits out of the way first. Need some new knickers. Don't need to see those. <laughs> um, and I also, um, I just needed some earrings because I wear my golden snitch ones that I haven't got them for my birthday like all the time. But because I have two holes now, um, and I just needed, I just wear like cheap Primark earrings. Um, I just change them every so often, just because they aren't probably the best bit ears. Um, so I just got this little set of earrings. I tend to wear silver more than gold, but I just saw that these and I thought they were really good. Um, for the price as well, £3.50 for 20 pairs of earrings. So yeah, I tend to, it's probably not the best environmentally, but the Primark ones, which I normally have in my front, my front first holes, when they start to feel either itchy or I can feel them not very nice, I take them out and put them in the bin and put a new pair in and clean my ears, obviously. But um, yeah, probably not so, probably not the best. But um, it's just some cheap earrings for me because I haven't got like proper like silver earrings or anything, so I just get cheap ones when I can. So what else do we get in here? Oh yeah, I've got some more um, socks. These are going to be like my gym socks. They wear in like the workout area. So you get three pairs for four pounds, and they are just they just say sports socks. So kind of more ankle style socks. So you get two of the navy and white stripes, and then you get one pair of black and white stripes and it gives you it's got a comfort top and arch support with a ventilation mesh so I've got those um, next oh this top actually is um from somewhere else so I'll just quickly show this <laughs> we got to Southampton quite late in the evening because my friend Kirsty had a contact lens appointment which went on a little bit longer and then we had dinner in Salisbury where she had the contact lens appointment. So we got back to Southampton a little bit late so we didn't actually get to do any shopping Saturday. And so I said, I swear that as the supermarket near the hotel has got closing. So we ran there because we both needed like a top to wear just to go out for a drink. Um, so we went in there and got them bits and bobs and I spotted this top. And I haven't worn it yet because I needed to show you guys first. I did get it in a size 16 and it's a white t-shirt but it's a Harry Potter one <laughs> and I thought it was really good for £9 because obviously it's Harry Potter. So we've got Hogwarts Castle and Hedwig and a little scroll. We've got Hogwarts Express sign We've got letters, we've got, what does that say, Harry Potter magical moments. <laughs> um, we've got that, we've got golden snitch, we've got the sorting hat, glasses, and I think that's the house crests on there. I can't actually see what I'm doing. And the Hogwarts Express. So, yeah. I thought that was really good for the price. Um, 
Unfortunately, Ravenclaws, it's, it's a raven on the jumper, on the top, not an eagle. But yeah, I just thought that would be a nice top to wear, which isn't dark. <laughs> um, so yeah, I got that in Asda and it was £9. Um, so that's that. The rest of this bag is Primark, back, back to Primark. <laughs> so, I've got another pair, another packet of earrings. These are two pounds, it's just a pack of 12. So I've got these, again, silver. I saw lightning bolts and I thought, oh, high price. <laughs> um, so I've got those, again, just as some cheap earrings. Um, what's this? Oh yeah, I've got these. They're probably not clips that I'll wear out, but I'll use these to keep my hair out of my face instead of using like headbands all the time, or claw clips. And they are high pot hair clips, but they're ones that leave no marks. So I thought that's why they'd be good to use when I'm doing if I put makeup on or when I put my skin stuff on. Um, yeah, so got those, and they were three pound fifty. Next, um, I got some of their like long line tops, which is like this one um, I'm wearing. I got this one a little while ago, but this one I got, and it's a nice light blue. Um, I'm a sucker for these like slogans. <laughs> so this was a size medium. I'll try and do some try on clips if I can. But because they're like really long oversized tops, I literally just wear it with leggings or cycling shorts. Um, I actually got this in a medium, which is 12 to 14, so I thought it looked really, really long. Um, so I just got this one in blue and it says confidence. Um, the Belief in oneself and what you are capable of. Believe in what you can achieve. <laughs> so yeah, I will try and put try on clips if I can in all pictures, just so you can see how long things look. Um, like I said, I've got this in a size medium, which is 12 to 14. So I've got that one. Um, what else did I get? Oh, I've got some of these um, crop tops which I will probably either use as like wearing underneath something um, or as like pyjamas maybe when it's a bit warmer um, I got them all in a size large, I did get a few colours um, they have got like extra banding support in them no cuts but it's got like the extra kind of stretchy um, bra type feel in it so it'll probably be better for when it is warmer. I'm hoping my boobs won't overspill too much. Um, I did get a size large, which is 14 to 16. Um, but yeah, I got this grey one. Um, I also got this kind of sage green, I suppose, one as well. I just thought they'd be good for when it get, does get warm and maybe as pyjamas, like pyjama tops. So yeah, I got those. They were uh, £3.50 each. They're seam free cami tops, it says on the label. So I've got a green one. I think I did get another colour, but it might be somewhere else in the bag. <laughs> so, next, I did pick up some of the skinny jeans I like. Um, I have got a 14 because obviously I want to try and get in, um, still keep on the losing weight train even though I'm currently taking a break from filming what I eat in the day at the moment. Um, but I did get the super high waist skinny jeans which is the ones, I'm hoping the ones that I've got on, I've got um, already um, and they were £10. So that's the label. Um, we were like stretching them like, are they the ones? <laughs> but um, I'm hoping they are. Um, but I did get this like kind of normal denim colour. Obviously I'll hopefully I'll try them on and I'll, we shall see. If not I'll be getting into them regardless. <laughs> um, I got those ones, but I did get another pair as well, um, which is somewhere in the bag. 
I got a couple of pairs of shorts because again I thought with the um, crop tops for pajamas in the summer. Um, I've got these in size large, and they were. Where's the label? <laughs> Three pound fifty as well. So yeah, I've got kind of sets of pajamas for like seven pound. So I just got these grey ones in size large again. And I did get some green ones, so I did kind of go with them, um, kind of matching, <laughs> but they're not exactly matching. And then I just got a pair of green ones as well. Again, three pound fifty in size large. They don't look too. As long as I don't have them too high, I don't think my bottom will be out. <laughs> but um, we shall see. So I've got those. This is um, just a light, light vest top. I just for again, wearing with leggings or cycling shorts. And I do like this blue colour. Um, I did get it in a 2XL. And you're thinking, why? I just thought it would just be nice and light and nice, better to be flowy and light than um, tight fitting. Um, so yeah, I just thought of it, it might be nice just to be a flowy top. Um, again, as I said, should be good on. And this one was £2. I wish I bought more of these. <laughs> um, so £2 for a vest top. They had all different colours as well, but I just went for that blue one. Um, next, oh, this is another crop top. I think this was in the pyjama section because it's a different shape. Um, so I've got another crop, kind of crop top, pyjama-esque top. <laughs> so I just got it in white. Um, and this one was £3.50 as well. I got this one in an XL because I couldn't find a large and maybe I can see the difference of how they look between the two sizes. It shouldn't be that much difference. So I've got that one. I also got this, oh, another vest top. I just got in black because I can't, can't have enough black, can you? <laughs> I did get this one in a size large, which is 14 to 16. This was £2.50, so just a plain black vest top. Again, just to wear like under checkered shirts or um, yeah, just under checkered shirts or just have a quick light top to put on. So I've got that one. We have oh, another long line t shirt in grey. So, this one, what size did I get this one in? This one was in a large, so probably slightly. Well, we'll be able to see the difference. I'm putting it on myself and it does look really long, like I could wear this as a dress. Um, so hopefully you can see how long it is. Obviously I'll show it on. Um, but this one is grey and it says, uh, it's okay not to be perfect all the time, to have bad days and amazing days, to choose what is best for you to be yourself. I'm a sucker for them. <laughs> so yeah like that it's just the only thing I find with light grey is if I get too hot I don't want it to show <laughs> so um yeah that's the only kind of thing that I worry about but I've got that one ah, here's my second uh, pair of jeans these are maybe more of a blue more bluey denim, denim? more of a bright blue denim Again, I got them in the super high waist skinny jeans in size 14 for £10. I think they may show a bit of a muffin top at the moment where I have um, not been losing weight, but we shall see. So I've got those. Um, I did buy some uh, underwear. So this, I probably might not show this in a try on because it's a bit. You don't really need to see it. <laughs> so I got this corset bra. I thought it looked really nice. Um, I did get it in a 38E, so it's slightly smaller than my normal bra, but that was the biggest I could find in the E. So 
yeah, it's kind of a corset collection and it's in this royal blue. Um, and this was £12, but I thought that was really, really nice for the colour and the, just the corset top itself. So I got that to wear. Um, I also got matching knickers to go with it. <laughs> Don't really need to see those. <laughs> and there's only a few things left in this I lot there because I oh, did have a couple of Kirstie's bits in my basket as well, so she's already taken her stuff. Um, so yeah, just a few items left, and then I'm going to try some bits on. So, another load of socks for the gym, or yeah, I'm going to try and keep them just for the gym. Again, in the workout range, microfiber lightweight trainer socks. Um, just in some little light colours. Again, comfort top and arch support and ventilation mess, mesh. So you've got this kind of pinky purple colour. You've got kind of a blue, dusty blue, uh, khaki green, um, kind of a cream, and brown. So yeah, some nice trainer socks, and again they were, doesn't tell me, luckily I have my receipt. Um, if you do want to know the prices, I'll try and put them all on the screen. Um, so, I don't know if I were to find them quickly. Uh, I think they're around £4 mark, like the other pair, pack of socks. So I got those. Um, I also got some of the gym leggings because my washing machine decided to make a hole in my Primark leggings that I got for the gym. Um, these are similar to what I had, they just got a different, slight different band in. The other one had a print, like um, some wording on the band in, but this one's just got, I don't know if you'll be able to see, kind of more of a plain banding but it's still different <laughs> so yeah it's just the plain black gym workout leggings from Primark they've got uh, seam bits on it's a bit hard to show you when they're plain black but um yeah it's the plain black gym leggings from workout range I did get them in this for the size large 14 to 16 and they were eight pounds so Hopefully, they'll be just as good as the other ones that I had. Um, so I've got those. Um, I did get a uh, hair detangling brush because my hair is always so knotty after the shower. And I just thought, instead of trying to rack my hair through my, um, my brush through my hair, sorry, I just picked up a uh, <laughs> detangler brush. Um, which was three pounds. So hopefully, when I wash my hair, I can just use this before brushing my hair properly and get all the knots out. Use to style and gently detangle your hair on the go. Suitable for all, all hair types, apparently. So hopefully that does the job. So we've got that, and the last two things are again some crop tops. <laughs> So I got this um, kind of light blue crop top, again in size large because I did, if now I could probably see the XL being comfier, I do want to kind of try and stick to my size that I should be wearing. <laughs> so yeah, size large, 14 to 16, and these are £3.50, so again, very versatile. They've got, actually got adjustable straps as well. So yeah, and they've got the extra support inside them. So that should be fine. So I've got this nice light blue colour. And last but not least, a very, very bright colour for me. <laughs> but I thought it could be very good for spring and summer. The other, other crop top, which is very, very bright in hot pink. <laughs> So again, size large and £3.50. So 
I am going to sort out how I'm going to try on what with what <laughs> and I'll come back to you and show you how things fit. So this is crop top number one. <laughs> um, obviously there's no padding or anything so you can't really wear it when it's cold but we have tighten the straps and um, I think it actually looks quite alright. These are the gym leggings by the way and yeah they're definitely like my other ones, high waisted, the band feels like it's really supportive and won't fall down. Um, Adam said he couldn't see my butt on like my pants but um, yeah I'm actually cleaning these crop tops. I might actually try them on with some shorts just because that's the vibe that I would wear them with when it's warmer but yeah absolutely loving these and I actually don't feel that self-conscious in it so yeah and I actually do like the really like the pink as well so yeah very very different for me and I'll only probably wear them when it is warm or as pyjamas <laughs> so yeah that is crop top number one and the gym leggings I'm really really happy with the gym leggings they fit really really well so um yeah definitely we'll have to try and get some more <laughs> so yeah I'll be back in a minute so this is the blue crop top I've readjusted the straps got my label <laughs> uh, this is a blue top crop top crop <laughs> crop top with the straps I've just put on some cycling shorts so you can see this is the kind of vibe that I was going for maybe <laughs> Um, yeah, so I really like the colour, they're really really soft and obviously again like I said you don't be able to wear them when it's not nippy basically. Um, but yeah, I think I actually look quite alright. Um, and I don't feel too self-conscious in it so um, I think if I was going out somewhere I'd put a t-shirt over it or like a checkered shirt or something over it because I don't know, it depends on how I feel at the time but um yeah this is the kind of vibe that I was going for with these tops um but yeah I think I've done really well with um the fact they are the size 14 to 16 and obviously I'm quite heavy on the top so um yeah I'm really really happy with these and yeah I'm gonna probably become one of the people who gets lots more of them <laughs> but yeah so this is the blue crop top so next I thought I'd show you this vest top. This is actually quite fitting, like tight fitting. Um, so yeah, be one to wear underneath stuff, I think, unless it's really, really hot and I'll be like this. But one thing I'm ecstatic about is these jeans. Just, um, this is the first pair, so I know the second pair should fit. They do, ah! Uh, <laughs> they're a bit snug but they do up they zip up they are on <laughs> and I'm so so happy I'm down a size in the high-waisted skinny jeans from Primark so yeah very very happy that these have gone on and they fit it's just obviously they're a bit snug from where I've been eating rubbish but um yeah so the first pair of jeans are on comfy and yeah very very happy so next is this long line t-shirt um, i've just put it on with cycling shorts so you can see how long it is and yeah very very long you could get away with leggings but i probably personally wear it like this with cycling shorts like in this weather for example we're having nice weather today as i'm filming this so yeah Long top like this I'd wear with cycling shorts. Um, if you wanted to you could wear it as a nighty, nighty I suppose. Um, so yeah, nice and flowy, not too tight. This was the size large um, one, so slightly bad, bigger. But yeah, obviously it's not meant to be like um, too, what's the word? It's just a casual t-shirt, it's just a throw on with leggings or something just something nice and comfy so yeah it's a nice comfy long t-shirt so just for comparison this is the blue one this is in size medium it's a bit more fitting around the arms and 
here. Like I can feel see more of my lumps and bumps. But I wouldn't say it's too much different lengthwise. Maybe just ever so slightly shorter. But it's still I'm literally gonna have it like this. Um over jeans or cycling shorts like this. Um but they're really really soft. Um so I would definitely recommend if you want some nice long t shirts. Um yeah, and this is a size medium. So you can see, I think you can see the difference. It's a bit more fitted slightly around the waist in the middle. Not, not, not that much difference in length. It's just probably, it's a little bit shorter because it's not covering my bum as much, but um, still gonna wear it. It's a nice long t-shirt. <laughs> um, so yeah, really, really comfy. Love the logo. And yeah, that's another nice long t-shirt. So this is the vest top which I've got in 2XL, so very, very baggy. I could tuck it in, I suppose, to um, jeans or literally just have it loose like this, maybe with the cycling shorts, but it's just a uh, nice blue, loose fitting vest top. As for the jeans, the jeans have gone on. They have done up just but these ones feel much tighter than the other ones even though they're supposed to be the same ones as the other ones and same size so i don't know maybe it's because i'm getting hot now changing clothes but these are the ball i don't know normal colored denim the other ones are more of a brighter blue i think but um yeah, they still fit, they're just very, very snug. <laughs> um, but yeah, I could have, if I really wanted to, got this top a bit smaller, but just on warm days, it's just nice to have flowy tops, I think. So this does nothing for my shape, but it would just be nice to have when I'm on something flowy and loose on, <laughs> um, especially in the warmer months. But yeah, so that's the best top and the second pair of jeans. Not many top sets, I promise. <laughs> so this is the grey crop top again. I'm not feeling too like self-conscious. I've done the straps so they feel a bit more high and supportive. Again, obviously you couldn't wear it when it's too cold. Not that I would anyway. But I actually feel like it looks okay with how my body's look changing. I tried it with the grey shorts because obviously it's grey and grey. Um, just really comfy. Um, so I've got them a bit high waisted, but my butt's not out or anything. So yeah, really, really comfy. They're not like riding up or anything. So yeah, big thumbs up from me. And yeah, I feel like I'm starting to get more confident with my body shape and how it's getting and feeling more positive about myself. Just want to quickly switch it around because I've just tried the, I'm not going to fully show you, the white top that I got. Very, very stretchy. It keeps folding up, hence I've tucked it into my shorts. I'm not going to show you it because it's very, very see-through. <laughs> so this will definitely be a pyjama top. Um, I don't know, this is, I think this is because it's one of the ones that's in, in the pyjama section. It's different to the other ones. It's got no adjustable straps or anything. So yeah, this one is not as good as the others. But this will definitely be a pyjama top. So I've just got one more crop top and shorts to show you. And I may even try on that high top I've got for myself as well. So not very much left. Right guys, so this is the last top crop top. I've only literally just shown it to you because of the colour. They are so, so soft if you do like wear these. Even if you don't feel comfortable wearing them out in public, you could wear them in like your back garden or something like that. Um, yeah, really, really comfy. The extra layer they have in them is for good support as well. Um, yeah, and the, the so socks, <laughs> the shorts again, obviously don't completely match, but again, they're comfy. Aren't riding up my bottom. Um, obviously you can see bumps and bumps and things, but they're just literally for either pajamas or lazing around in the garden. So yeah, I'm really, really happy I bought a good few of these because I think they're going to be staples in the summer. But um, yeah, so that's the last crop top. I'm just going to go and grab the Harry Potter top I got from Asda and then that'll be it. 
So this is the last thing. Obviously, this is from Asda, so not Primark. Um, the Harry Potter t-shirt I've got. I've got it in a size 16. A little bit of wiggle room. Um, I don't know if you'd say it's quite see-through. I have got a white bra on underneath. But to me, in the mirror, I feel like I can see through it, like my stomach area. But I don't know if it's because I've got dark bottoms on. But, um, yeah. Very, very happy. Nice fit. Um, again, I feel like I've gone down slightly in the size in Asda because I can be um, sometimes a bit hit and miss with Asda. Um, but yeah, it's got a little bit of room in it. Um, so yeah, I'd literally just wear it like this with jeans, um, jeggings, potentially maybe shorts in the summer if I wear it. But because I feel like it looks a little bit see-through, I don't know if I'll get like worry about getting too hot and being able to see for it but it's just a nice top to wear jeans I think nice comfy top um, so yeah just the basic normal length t-shirt and it's got all of my amazing Harry Potter images on so yeah so I hope you enjoyed my Primark haul uh, please be kind obviously I am still becoming more confident and more body, body positive with myself. Um, I know it's not my usual kind of clothing either, I'm trying to step out and wear things that I want to wear but don't feel confident in and I will get the confidence to eventually. So yeah, that is my Primark haul for April. These aren't an occurring thing, they don't happen all the time. Um, but yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please don't forget to leave a big thumbs up. If you're brand new to my channel, hello and welcome. Please hit that subscribe button as I'm trying my hardest to get to a thousand subscribers. I would love for you to stick around. So take care and I'll speak to you very soon in the next one. Bye.